Oh, what's up guys? So, it's a Sunday. It's about, I don't know, 16 degrees. It's feeling like summer. It's gorgeous. Um, it is a Sunday, so it's going to be bloody busy on the roads. My plan is, if I don't bump into anybody, that I will go to Cheddar, and then I'm going to see if I can find any nice roads around Cheddar. We've got some tire, new tire, or newish tires on. I kind of skimped out and bought some partly worn ones because I bought a new helmet. So, oh, he looks like he's gunning it. Oh, and I've got two really floppy mirrors because I haven't tightened them up fully or they've gone loose. So, I need to do that. So, hopefully, I do find someone who can have some banners on them. I doubt it. I got a new helmet coming, ready for the TT, and I'm just setting up the bike. So I've ordered some new fork seals, ready for the TT, because it's the end of this month. It's May the... I don't even know. I'm, uh, end of May, start of June is when the TT is. I'm hoping, right, I'm hoping by actual summer, the, uh, the Duke, uh, the Duke, <laughs> the KTM will be done. Now, I know it's been like, I know I've been saying about this for ages. I've had the bike for fucking ages. Um, it's getting there. It, they've actually got the, 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 the parts that are getting powder coated. One to two weeks, got about a week and a half left because I've only just chucked them in with these guys down in, which I'll give them a shout out, why not? Bristol, um, Bristol motorcycle powder coating. The guy there that does it, spot on like actually a genuine guy I said about doing half and half wheels and he said that's not really proper powder coating the way they do it and stuff and he was proper genuine he said I don't have those colors you'd have to buy those colors I could do this I could do that like was it trying to skip me out and, he, and then he goes you know what I'll do it all for X amount you know and I was like that's a decent price I'm gonna go with you and he, he, he knows he's, he's been doing it ages so he knows about what bits to do on a bike and not to fucking shop blast the um, things and whatever. So he's, he's a genuine good guy. He's shop blasting it, powder coating it, and then putting a lacquer over it so it'll be protected. So it's gonna look good. I'm not gonna tell you the colors, it's gonna look good. Um, it is a KTM. I'll give you the name of her already because she does already have a name Daisy 2.0. Okay. My little KTM Duke 125 was called Daisy. Obviously, Daisy Duke for Duty Hazard, so it had to be J Daisy, you know, it had to have to be. This is, this is, uh, the, the, the Duke 125 is being reborn into the Big Daddy. I'm not sure what the future plans are with this bike because I'm gonna have to get a car soon. And as stupid as it is, I'm getting old. <laughs> I'm getting old now. That's a penis. <laughs> and uh, I need to start planning for the future. So it's time for a car. And when, once I've got a car, I don't know if I'll need. I don't know if I'll need two bikes so I don't know if I'll keep this I might do but I'll have my KTM so it's like eh, eh I don't know if I can afford two bikes and a car we'll see we'll see I, I don't I'm not very good at planning stuff I do it all on the spot like it's fucking annoying because I just can't I, I, there's nothing wrong with this bike I love it to bits absolutely love it I would never need another bike but I just I can't keep things for long periods of time I suck at it I was like yeah I'll buy this thing I won't buy another bike I love it and then my plans change and shit Ew, but no I want to I want to try and keep this if I can I'll keep it <sighs> pardon me and then what the plan was, was that I'd have this to go to work in that. 
I'd have a car for, you know, every other stuff that you do with cars. Um, and then the KTM was going to be my weekend machine or going to the twisties and stuff because if I crushed on that KTM, for one, the parts are cheaper and two, there's going to be less damage on it. Whereas you go down on something like this, the fairings are just fucked and you got to buy all new fairings and clip on snap and oh, it's, it's not a good day when you crush a Super Sport. Whereas a Super Motor, you can normally just pick them up, give them a kick and they'll get you home. So that's the ideal scenario. Now, actually, the ideal scenario would be a van and then I can take the KTM to other places all the way to like because I wouldn't want to do a long trip on the KTM um, so it's like chuck it in the van go to North Wales enjoy the rides over there take it to some tracks some proper supermotor tracks and do that. that that's that would be the ideal plan but we'll see we're, like I'm planning for things that just wow well, I haven't even fucking started lessons yet like that fast that was quite slow <laughs> it's, it, it's it's more the fact how fast it gets to it it's just insane I love it oh, I'm definitely gonna have to find some different roads cheddar is dead like I'm hoping it's like this tomorrow because I've got the day off tomorrow and my new helmet's coming so I kind of want to test out, you know, where where to mount the camera and everything like that. Uh. That's why I didn't turn my camera off. I saw a Husqvarna nuda. The first ever Husqvarna Nuda I've ever seen in my life, in person. Oh my god, it was gorgeous. Oh, I think I need to clean up myself. Oh Jesus. Oh wow. <sighs> I seen a Husqvarna Nuda. I so hope it comes back down and I can stare at it. That's the reason I couldn't have a Husqvarna Nuda, because I think I would have a relationship with it. God, it's gorgeous. This literally, a shit ton of these people, I don't know what kind of group it is, came past a minute ago. There's been two, well, actually, this is a third set of people. And I mean, there's like a good 40 people in each one. We'll go see if we can find them in a minute. A lot of them are on Kawasaki, so I don't know if there's some Kawasaki meat. I tried to record the first lot and uh, I swapped my SD card and the SD card didn't work so I've only got a 16 gig SD card in there at the moment but we'll see if we can find them there's just more and more of them coming I reckon there's got to be over I reckon there's got to be close to probably 200 actually like 50 people in each group maybe more it's crazy crazy see where they're all going to crazy right we're charging and recording I was going to go for a spin, and then some more people turned up, and then that big squad of people turned up. There's more! Even more of them. It's got to be a Kawasaki meat, because, Jesus, the amount of Kawasaki Z800s and stuff, Z1000, that are turning up, it's ridiculous. Jesus Christ. That's ridiculous. That's so cool. slow in a 
us up then. Look, it's a fucking cyclist. Like, swear to God. Seriously. Ah. <sighs>